It really is all about community. I want to talk about Google Plus communities and I've wanted to talk about Google Plus communities for a while because they're one of my favorite parts of Google Plus because they're really, 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 really helpful in finding people to engage with who are actually active on Google Plus. I run a couple of communities. I have communities that are part of paid programs like BAM and the Rockstar Guides. And I also have a free community, which I'm gonna give you a little insights onto in just a minute, called Hit The Mic VIP. And that's my VIP community for people who sign up for the VIP list and want access to uh, engage with me in a community I'm in all the time. And also engage with other people who love hit the mic and, and this stuff that I talk about. I wanna talk about why I chose a Google Plus community over a Facebook group or a LinkedIn group for not only my paid programs, but also for my free opt-in program. Uh, and I will say, disclaimer, I do have a Facebook group for the Rockstar Guide too, but that it's only because there's a Rockstar Guide to Facebook and it would be weird not to have a Facebook group for that. I prefer Google Plus communities because of the way they're organized. You can have a really inclusive group that's also really clear content wise because you do have the ability to break your conversation down into categories. Um, I'm actually gonna show you what this looks like in just a minute, but that really allows people to go in and get exactly what they need from your community uh, but you are able to foster all kinds of conversations within one place. So that's my favorite part of communities. Again, I want to stress the fact that if you don't find communities with your ideal clients or you don't find communities with your your peer group in them, start them. It's the fastest way to put yourself in a leadership position and really make yourself stand out in the industry because if you're looking for it and not finding it, I guarantee you someone else is too. This is the VIP community, Hit The Mic VIP community. This is the one I said, uh, I mentioned that is totally free that I run. Uh, what I wanted to point out is this right over here that you can break down the conversation uh, by by what you're talking about. You know, If we're talking about social media, great email marketing, podcasting, whatever it is, it's really easy for you to jump in uh, and see what's what. So you can go in and see the introductions. It's really easy for you to go in and see the social media questions or conversations, I should say. And then, you know, like I ran the challenge for the build a better business challenge over the summer, I think we ran it. Uh, and here it is, all of that stuff is in one place. So it's really easy for you to jump in and get exactly what you want inside of one community. So what I would love for you to do is hit the comments below, tell me your favorite community to engage in, or send me a link to a community you just created. And then of course, also like the video uh, and come connect with us in the VIP community uh, for this show and for the podcast that I have. Um, again, it's hit the mic VIP and there'll be a link in the annotation below. Uh, and of course, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any episodes of Hit The Mic TV in the future. I'll see you next time. Bye. I hear from people saying that networking is split into two pieces, online networking and offline networking. And I completely disagree.